Greetings everyone and welcome to question number 6 of US examination mathematics 1 section. For this question we have chosen a question which was already asked in US examination in the year 2013. So let's see what the question asks us and what is the process we need to follow to get to the right answer. In this question we have x plus y equals uh, uh, minus 2, a minus b equals minus 1 and we are asked bx plus by minus ax minus a y. What do we do in these kinds of questions? We always try to look for the common factors because as we look for the common factors we will be, we will be able to bring this expression into the form where we can use x plus y and a minus b. So let's do that. The common factor for, uh, for uh, bx plus by is b times x plus y. For the common factor for ax uh, minus ax minus ay is minus a, so we have x plus y. Now, what is another way of writing, wh what can be another way of writing this expression? As you can see, b and a and minus a, they have both common, uh, the same common factor, which is x plus y. So I can write this b minus a times x plus y. Now, what is the value of BA? Since we are given only A minus B, which is equal to minus 1, so we have A plus 1, which is equals B, so we know that B minus A is equal to 1. So we found the value of B minus A, which is 1, times we know the value of X plus Y, which is minus 2, so this is all equal to minus 2. As you can see, this is the process you need to follow to get to the right answer. Just make sure you find the common factors because as you may, as you find the common factors, the rest is going to be very easy because it will enable you to simplify your work as much as possible. This was question number six and I will see you on the next one.